Excadrill is one of the best Pokemon in Yu but it's countered by one thing, Skarmory. That's why we're going to be using an Excadrill Sand Team with Magnet Pull Magneton to trap and kill Skarmory. And what I want you to do right now is to pause the video and comment down your prediction of how many kills you think Magneton will get and why. Let's begin. Alright, we get a game. There is no Steel type unfortunately, well actually no Steel type we can trap with Choice Specs Magneton, but we do have a good matchup with our own extra deal potentially. And even Latias could be really good, it's gonna be an interesting matchup. I'm thinking this could be a hyper offensive team, right? And if it's a hyper offensive team, he's probably Focus Sash lead extra deal. That's my guess right now. Amoongus is a good wall for a lot of his team actually, but right now I'm focused on that being a lead extra deal right now. So I do have options, right? I'm thinking of just leading Amoongus and using Foul Play. Yeah, he does lead Extra Jill. I don't want to spore this right now. So let's just go ahead and Foul Play, get good damage. After the Foul Play, he'll probably go to Lati, but we do have a Mandibus and we do have Gigalith to check to Extra Jill to check. Lati is not a problem and Lati is the main way he's going to make damage on the Amoongus, Lati and Hydreigon. He uses Earthquake, which actually does a lot of damage. Ooh, this is going to be tough. We might have to spore right now. I didn't want to have to spore right now, but I think just to keep extra drill away, we have to spore right now. He goes to Lati. Okay, so he's giving us Lati. Now, I want to go to Mandibuzz right now. Do you think he'll go to Azumarill predicting Mandibuzz? That's the question I have right now. And alternatively, will he go extra drill predicting Mandibuzz? I really want a Giga Drain predicting the switch out because he's definitely going to be expecting Mandibuzz. I'm going to Giga Drain here. There we go. He... Goes to Hydreigon, which I find interesting. I don't know why you'd go Hydreigon on the Mandibuzz. Let's go Gigalith right now. Because Gigalith is specially defensive and it gets the boost in the sand because it's a rock type. So let's go Gigalith on the Hydreigon right now. And I do have to be a little careful about that extra drill right now. Going Gigalith would be really helpful because it means Sandrush extra drill can become a good revenge killer later in the game. We go to Gigalith. What is he going to do? He uses Nasty Plot, okay. This is going to be tough. We definitely live a hit, right? So should we Rock Blast or should we Toxic maybe? Rock Blast could be good. It'll put it'll be good for Extra Jill too. I'm, he's probably going to have to Draco. Let's Toxic because this might be Nasty Plus. No, it, I don't think it would be Nasty Plot Roost on a Hyper Offensive team. Let's Rock Blast and then go Mandibuzz later. Yeah, Draco does 80, which is a lot. Probably Life Orb. Yeah, it is Life Orb. No! Why does this always happen to us? Okay. Now we're in trouble. We can go to Extra Jill maybe on a Nasty Plot. Let's try doing that. Please tell me. Okay, we dodge an eye for an eye, right? Actually, we didn't want to dodge that. I think we wanted uh, the, the damage from Recoil. He goes to Aegislash. Okay, we get him with the Iron Head. He sacrifices his Balloon. Not a good play. He might go to Lati, maybe. Um, and Superpower on Gigalith is something to consider. It'll hit Extra Jill and... Hydreigon, so I'm going to consider putting that move on Gigalith. Now we have options. Zygarde is threatening. We might have to sacrifice Magneton. Um, Amoongus is bulky, right? Let's go to Amoongus. Thousand Arrows to 38 only. I think we can foul play and then sacrifice Magneton. Or... Yeah, because we do want damage, right? Let's foul play here. Okay. Okay, we foul play, we get 54, okay. Now let's sacrifice Magneton, is that the right play? We can go Mandibuzz too, Mandibuzz is bulky as well. Thousand Arrows, 42 only, but we can Roost right now, and what is he going to do? Is he going to go to Azumarill? He doesn't really have a lot of options right now. He goes to Extra Jill, we'll just knock this off right now, and... Yeah, we're slowly setting up the game for... Okay, it's Rock Tomb. Okay, we're slowly setting up the game for the Extra Jill Sweep right now. 33. It is, in fact, Focus Sash. This is probably Stealth Rock Rapid Spin last. So we can just roost on the Stealth Rock right now. Oh, he smacked us down. Yeah, we can keep roosting though, right? Yeah, we can definitely keep roosting. He goes to Azumarill now. I'm going to Toxic because I really think this is going to be Belly Drum. Let's go ahead and get a Toxic off right now. Yeah, there we go. We get the Toxic off. He's going to be taking damage. And Lati resists the uh, his last move, right? So we have to be a little strategic about managing our sand. But we can maybe sacrifice Amoongus here. Go Gigalith maybe. We have options. Let's just go to Amoongus right now. 
we'll sacrifice it here. Play rough. Uh, we we die, but we do Rocky Helmet. Brings it to 40. Now we can go to Latias and throw off a Psychic right now. And at some point, we'll have our Gigalith sacrifice in the back for Extra Jill. And then we should be in good shape. Oh, I get it now. The Thousand Arrows smacked me down. I forgot about that. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I'm just, I'm, I completely forgot that I was smacked down. I was like really wondering why did Rock Tomb do that to me? Okay. Let's Draco here. Yeah, there we go. I wonder if the Lottie is like, I wonder what that Lottie item is basically, but we should be winning with our Gigalith Extra Jill combo. Yeah, he goes to Zygarde, but that's going to be an easy sacrifice right now. There we go. Now we can go to Extra Jill. We can even Swords Dance here, right? Yeah, we can do that on the Outrage and then we can sweep. Right? Iron Head here, and it's going to be game over. Yeah, he forfeits. Okay, we get another game where this is a kind of- is this a rain team? It's certainly an interesting team. Again, it's really weak to extra drill if we can remove the Gyarados. Let me think, is that lead Mammo? That definitely could be lead Mammo. Um, I wish I was Scarf- actually Scarf Magneton wouldn't help right now. But, actually it would help versus Durant, but I think it, it'll be fine because extra drill can beat it anyway. I'm really scared of that Mammo Swine. It's probably a lead Mammo Swine as well. I could go to Amoongus. I live one hit, right? He goes to Durant. I'm thinking of either using Foul Play or Spore right now. If this is 56, okay. 16. Foul Play to 35. Let's go Magneton on the Exorcist right now. 57. Oh, that is a lot. That is a lot of damage. Okay, we have to dodge. We don't get the dodge. Okay. That was a lot of damage. Okay. Let's Earthquake or Iron Head? I think he's going to go Gyarados, right? Uh, let's Iron Head. Yeah, he does go Gyarados. We get... It is Leftovers Gyarados too. Let's go to Gigalith. And we should be able to KO with Rock Blast. That Durant is strong. I wish I was uh, Specs Magneton. A uh, Scarf Magneton. Yeah. Gigalith is strong. So we should be able to live one hit. Yeah, there we go. No, okay, okay, okay. Now we have to think. Okay, let's go to Amoongus right now. Waterfall, we get the chip damage. Is he going to bounce right now? Even if he bounces, I can't touch him, right? We can Giga Drain maybe? We can Foul Play. Okay, it's Outrage. Okay, that's not the end of the world. That is definitely not the end of the world right now. And Extra Jill is looking really good right now. Let's go ahead and lead with Extra Jill right now. I wonder if he'll go to Politoed. Politoed could be annoying for Sand right now. Okay. It's, it is Air Balloon. That is... Okay, That that's kind of bad right now. Let's go for the flinch, maybe. And I don't think we get one hit KO'd anyway. Let's Iron Head. Flinch, okay. And let's Earthquake. There are, there are no switch-ins anymore to Earthquake. Let's go. And he has to go to Politoed, I assume, right? Or maybe he doesn't want to go to Politoed. Let's Earthquake here. Yeah, there we go. Now he goes to Mamoswine, but that's not really good enough, is it? Let's Iron Head here. Oh, that lives. Wow. Endeavor, okay, it's that Ice Shard set, right? Let's go to... I think we have to sacrifice Gigalith here. Or maybe we don't have to sacrifice Gigalith. Let's go to Mandy Buzz then. He uses Scald. I'm going to use this as an opportunity to knock off right now. I could even Toxic here too. 22, Leftovers removed. He gets the Toxic off. I hope this doesn't have Rest. And I wonder what he's going to do right now. I do have the Gigalith sack in the back, so I'm not worried about anything too much. But let's go ahead and get Mandibus back to full. Magneton... I had high hopes for Magneton, but it's not been doing a lot so far. Let's go to... Lati now. Actually, is that a good idea? We do have to be careful about first impression from Durant. Uh, let's just go Lati on a Scald. He goes to Durant. This is going to be first impression, probably. Let's go to Gigalith. It's Exorcist, so it doesn't have first impression. So we should be fine. Let's throw off an Earthquake. There we go. And now Lottie should win the game. He goes to Mammoth Swine. Heal Ice Shard. Yeah, that's fine. Ice Shard isn't going to be doing enough. And we should win the game with Lottie. There there we go. Not doing enough. Uh, should we Psychic? Yeah, let's Psychic here. 39. Don't have Rest. Scald. No Burn. Yeah, we're going to win. Let's get one more game. He does forfeit. Okay, we get one more game. This guy has a Reggie, a Lucky, and a Tapu Bulu. And he has a Skarmory. The Skarmory that we can trap. And that's the thing about Magneton. Some matchups, you can't do anything, right? Because 
they don't have a Skarmory, but in those matchups, Extreal will necessarily be good because there is no Extreal check. So it's kind of like a trade-off right now. Um, we are a little bit weak to Mammal Swine right now. I could lead Amoongus predicting the Mammal. Yeah, so let's go ahead and Spore right now. We don't die to any one hit. Oh, don't flinch me. Okay, there we go. That's good. We can Foul Play now. He goes to Ments, that's going to take a lot of damage. 40 only, okay. Let's go to Gigalith here. And this might have Earthquake, but we should live any one hit. That is Banded, isn't it? That is Banded. Okay, let's go to Lati, I think would be a good option. Yeah. Now we have a free Psychic right now. I think he might go to Tapu Bulu. Let's throw off a Psychic right now. Yeah, he does go to Bulu. Psychic, 61. Oh, what if it's Scarf? Okay, it's not Scarf, that's good. Yeah, Lottie is going in right now. And if he goes Skarmory, he's going to have to worry about that Magneton. The Mammal Swine is asleep too. We are in good shape right now with Extra Jill. And the opponent forfeits, so let's get one more game. Already we get another game and we get another Skarmory matchup. And the problem is that he does have Tangrowth, which can wall Extra Jill. So this is not an amazing Extra Jill matchup, but it could be a potentially amazing matchup for Latias. So if we can trap Skarmory, Latias is going to be really good right now. He doesn't really have anything that beats Amoongus. Like, everything loses to Amoongus right now. Maybe he can go to Nidoking to beat Amoongus, but it's really tough for him right now. Yeah, he leads with Nidoking. We should live any one hit. Let's go ahead and Spore right now. We should live, for example, Ice Beam, right? Yeah, we live Ice Beam. Let's go ahead and Spore. He goes to Tangrowth, but... See, what we can do now is we can Sludge Bomb or Spore predicting a switch out. I don't know what he's going to do, so I'm going to go Sludge Bomb here. He knocks us off. He's going to take damage, we're going to get Sludge Bomb, potentially a Poison too, 74, Poison, no Poison. And that was a really big risk for probably no reason, because it makes this team really weak to Extra Drill. Let's go ahead and potentially Giga Drain right now. He goes to Skarm. He should be really scared of Magneton right now. So I'm going to go ahead and Spore, predicting Needle King. Okay, maybe he's not scared of Magneton. Let's go to Magneton now. There we go. Volt Switch should one-hit KO, right? Yeah, there we go. Easy, that's really easy. Now we go to Gigalith, get the sand up. So put that kill counter at one right now. Magneton has killed one Pokemon. And what is going to beat Lati right now? Absolutely nothing. Even Tangrowth can barely check Extra Jill right now. It's going to be a real, real pounding by Extra Jill right now. He goes to Crawdont. I'm a little scared, but Knockoff is going to be weak because we removed the item. Okay, it's weak, more powerful than I thought. Bit of trouble right now. Amoongus is valuable. So under no circumstance am I going to lose it. Let's go Mandibuzz here. If he Crab Hammer is good for him. Yeah, he uses Knockoff right now. Let's U-turn right now. He goes to Sloking. That's going to take damage. And we have options right now. We can go to Amoongus or we can go to Extra Drill or Magneton. Let's go to Amoongus so we can get Regen. Do we outspeed? Okay, it's a speed tie, but we do have some speed EVs right now. So I'm going to go ahead and Spore. We do have speed EVs on Amoongus for the speed tie situation. He goes Nido King now, we get the Spore, now we can Giga Drain. We do only 30, which is not enough. We can go to Mandibuzz, which because it might not be useful, right? Let's go to Mandibuzz here, and let's knock off. Remove the Life Orb to make Nido King much less of a threat. There we go. We remove Life Orb, let's Roost right now, and might Stealth Rock here. Yeah, only 43. We can keep Roosting up. Thunderbolt, 42. Yeah, without a Life Orb, Nido King is not that good. He goes to Primarina now. We can go to we can go to Magneton on a Steel type move, on a Fairy type move. Yeah, this is fine, right? Now what do we do? Let's keep let's Thunderbolt here. And uh, he might go Nido King right now. So we do have to be a little careful. He might go Nido King right now. Yeah, he does go Nido King. Let's go to Mandibuzz and then U-turn. Like we switch on the Earth Power and then U-turn. He might double switch to Primarina here. Like I'm tempted to Thunderbolt right now. I'm really tempted to do, to do that. Should I do it? Make a heat play right now and Thunderbolt on his predict? I could do that. Okay. Well, it didn't really work out, but we can go to Mandibus now. Yeah, he uses Ice Beam. Let's U-turn right now and go to Extra Drill. And something is going to get hit by Earthquake right now. Nido King dies, and now Amoongus is basically going to win. Amoongus and Lottie. We can probably Swords Dance, right? Okay, 
Let's Iron Head now, go for the flinch. 42. Oh, it's Rocky Helmet. He misses the Sleep Powder. We can Earthquake now. He goes to Crawdon, and this is going to be game over right now. Should we SD again? Let's Iron Head go for the flinch. 43. Flinch. There we go. And it should be a wrap right now. Exergil cleans up. And he made the mistake of letting Tangrel get weak in the first place. Let's go ahead. And he was going to lose to Lati and Amoongus anyway. This just made it faster. He does forfeit. Let's get one more game. All right, we get another game. And this time it's like a hyper offense with Celesteela. Now, the problem is that Magneton, to be honest, doesn't actually deal with Celesteela because it might have Flamethrower. Flamethrower or Earthquake. So I have to be really careful about that. I'm thinking of leading with Gigalith. See, I'm actually really weak to Celesteela. I'm thinking of leading with Gigalith and Rock Blasting the Azelf. He should be taunting for my Stealth Rock, right? Um, he should be taunting for the Stealth Rock, right? He uses Knock Off. He removes the Smooth Rock, okay. We only hit... Let's Stealth Rock here. He will only, we don't hit enough times right now, but I think we should get Stealth Rock up for Lati, for example. Stealth Rock up. Let's Rock Blast here. Let's keep missing the Rock Blasts, okay. Yeah, and that, that Celesteel is going to be a problem right now. Okay, we finally get the hit. Azelf is gone, but now what? He might go to Diggersby. Yeah, he does go to Diggersby. Um, we can go to Mandibuzz predicting like an Earthquake. He uses Swords Dance and we are officially in trouble right now. Exergil can live any one hit, so that's, uh, that's not an issue. I do want Mandibuzz alive. I want everything on my team alive, to be honest. Um, okay. Lati could be the most expendable, right? Well, not really. I kind of do want it to live one hit for Celesteela. Amoongus is valuable, is it though? It might not be valuable. Let's go Amoongus and sacrifice it. Body Slam, Rocky Helmet, a Life Orb, please. There we go, Life Orb. Let's go to Extra Zone now. I think Earthquake to kill, and then we can figure it out from there. Yeah, okay. 47 is a lot, actually. Let's see what he goes to now. I wonder if he'll go to Celesteela immediately. I don't think he can, can he? He goes to Celesteela. Should we Rapid Spin or Iron Head going for a flinch? Rapid Spin could be good to remove hazards, but do I really want them removed? 450, 480. Thing is, after an after a speed boost, Celesteela will outspeed Extra Jill, right? Let's just Rapid Spin then. Who cares? Yeah, he does outspeed now. I'm interested to see, is it like a flamethrower set or what exactly is going to go on? Let's rapid spin again. Why were we faster? Is that modest? So it does have flamethrower. Okay. It does have flamethrower. Now, how do we plan this out right now? Magneton. It probably doesn't live a hit, does it? Let's go to Lati. Let's calm mind here. Okay, and let's Draco right now. Okay, we're going to be in big trouble. Yeah, this team is not good versus Celesteela. Yeah, yeah, okay. Let's forfeit this game. And let's get one more to end on a good note. Okay, we get a Fire Spam team, which... It's kind of annoying for Extragil because I can't break through Moltres and Tangrowth. Gigalith could have a good matchup. Conkledor could be annoying. Lati looks really good right now. In fact, Lati could is a match winner. Lati is definitely a match winner right now. Let's go to Gigalith. He leads with Nidoking right now. I think he might Stealth Rock. Let's go Lati. He does Stealth Rock. Let's get a Psychic off right now. There is no switch in. Is this Assault Vest Primarina? 42 special drop, no, no drop. It takes sand damage, so the next time around it will die. Let's go to Amoongus here. It uses Moon Blast, oh, that is that is specs damage, isn't it? Let's Giga Drain here. He goes to Tangrowth. He's probably trying to bait, right? He, he's probably trying to bait the Sludge Bomb and he goes to Nidoking. Let's Spore, or not, I guess. I think I'm over predicting right now. What do we do now? Let's go to Magneton. Okay, and let's Flash Cannon here. Something's gonna have to take a large hit right now. Let's go Flash Cannon. 
78. The drop too, okay. Let's go to Mandibuzz now. And let's knock off here. Okay. And now he probably goes to Primarina. It is choice specs as we know. And I'm going to probably rapid spin on the Primarina at some point. He goes to Darm first. Let's go Gigalith on the Darm. Flare Blitz does a lot of damage. Uh, we could Stealth Rock for Darm coming later. Yeah, there we go. He goes to Conkleder now, and now is the time to probably sacrifice Mandibus. It's done its job. Yeah. Now, we can throw off another Psychic with Lottie. I really want to Roost, but I'm scared he might stay in and knock. I think he's going to sack Primarina, though. He sacks Tangrowth, okay. Yeah, let's go for the kill right now. And that Darm might become a problem. We do have to be careful about the Darm. He goes to Moltres. We can Roost on that. Oh, is it Scarf? No, it's not. Okay. Yeah, Air Slash doesn't do enough. Let's Roost again. Yeah, that's not enough. Let's Roost again one more time. Should we Calm Mind? Yeah, let's Calm Mind. Okay. Oh, it has a Defog. Okay. Uh, let's pick off something with Psychic. 83. Okay. And let's Roost again. We want to stay out of Conkluder's Mac Punch range. Psychic here, okay. And what does he do? He goes to Darm. Let's go just go to Gigalith, get our Smooth Rock back up. Flare Blitz does a lot. I think that might be... Oh, no, no, that could just be... Uh, yeah, that could be Scarf. Okay. Now we can go to Exegil here. Let's Earthquake. And something should be fainting. Yeah, let's go. Primarina, that's gonna go. Let's go to... Magneton here, let's sacrifice Magneton. Yeah, and now Lottie should get a kill with Psychic, right? Yeah. And we should win with Exergil. There we go. Yeah, GG, that's going to be the end of the live. And yeah, thank you for watching.